Hi, I'm Ben Walton and two years ago I broke the world record for endurance ironing. I ironed for 60 hours non-stop and I ironed 961 pieces in the process. Now why would anyone want to iron for 60 hours? Well I'm a third generation dry cleaner, I've been running my own dry cleaners now for 8 years. Uh, I also was trying to raise some money for charity, I was raising money for the neonatal unit at Winchester Hospital where my son was born 10 weeks premature. Um, as an expert ironer, the nice people at Morphe Richards have asked me to introduce the quickest iron shirt section of the World Ironing Championships. Now there are a few rules to follow. When you're doing a shirt, it has to start off crumpled, collar, sleeves, cuffs and the body of the shirt all have to be ironed. Uh, and also when you finish, the quality of the shirt has to be wearable. And that means it's got to be quite a good quality of finish at the end. I'm going to have a go now. I'm going to give you some tips as I go along, see how I get on. First of all, start with the collar. Now you want to make sure you've got a decent iron that's full of water because you're going to need a lot of steam. When you're doing the sleeves, make sure the seam is nearest to you. You're going along the, the sleeve, getting a nice crease in the top, and then doing the cuff at the end. Flip the shirt round, get the second sleeve, again seam towards you at the bottom of the ironing board. Get a nice crease along the top, use both hands to get into the little bits at the top near the cuff and then go over the cuff. Now we're going to move on to the front body of the shirt. Start with the side with the buttons because you're going to have to zoom in and out of all of those. I would always say give it a blast of steam between each button. That's the front sorted. First lay of the back, there's a little pleat at the back there. Use both hands. One hand is obviously controlling the iron, the other is making sure the, the shirt is in the right place and all the pleats are in the correct place as well. The back of the shirt done, moving on to the final part, the front of the shirt. There's a pocket there, that's got to be good. Up the button line, all over the front of the shirt, again plenty of steam. And there's my shirt. Grab a hanger, pop it on, the quality's good. That's my effort. Have a go. See how you get on.